So if you've been to Kakariko Village, you've probably noticed that these two armor sets are wildly expensive. 5,000 rupees for each piece. That's insane, man. Bidenomics has definitely taken root here. But the shopkeeper says that if we help her little sister heal their grandmother's gloom sickness, the price will reduce drastically, which is a good thing because I was about to throw down the full 5,000 since I'm currently holding a huge stash of rupees. So this is her little sister. If you sneak up behind her, you can get a quick sniff of her hair. I believe this was the same girl we collected fireflies for during another quest in the previous game called Breasts Gone Wild. She asked me to make porridge for her grandmother that can cure gloom sickness. And she told me that porridge is made with Hylian rice, milk, and the generic term wild greens. So I assumed wild greens could be any of the veggies, but the one that cures gloom, I believe, is the Sunday lion, if I'm not mistaken. And I guess I wasn't, because Granny inhaled that porridge and made an immediate full recovery. Then they gave me a different type of porridge as a reward. I guess the house was just overrun with various types of porridge, so I'll take it. After that, I went back to the shopkeeper and purchased all six pieces of armor for 4,200 rupees. That's less than the price of one single piece before making a bowl of porridge, so it was definitely worth it. So then I ended up just west of the dueling peaks. Then this guy told me about three keys that are born of water that I need to insert into these three altars. It took me a while to figure this one out, but eventually I threw some ice fruit into the lake and suddenly a key was born of water. Then I just repeated this two more times, using fire to make the keys smaller so they would fit into their respective altars. All that was left to do after that was to ascend and activate the Yochisu Shrine. You know, the rapidly rising uh, um, uh, in with, uh, with uh, I don't know. Uh, and of course, we've got another blessing. A big battery, nice. Well, that's 98 shrines so far and there are plenty more to go. So I'll be moving on to the next one very soon. I hope to see you then. Thanks for watching.